local Muslim community is condemning those attacks. As KKLI's Christine Lazar tells us, local members are stressing that the attack was the work of a few extremists. Another wild pursuit today. This time, suspected bank robbers were tossing money out of the window, and plenty of people were rushing into the street to pick it up. It started to believe to the, be the bank manager's boyfriend. He's out on bail. Tonight, the suspect in yesterday's chase and shootout is hospitalized with gunshot wounds. But as KKL 9's Dave Lopez explains, he's not the first one in his family to be involved in a shootout with police. The attacks in Egypt and Libya may have been coordinated, and it may be no coincidence that they occurred on the anniversary of September 11th. Some are also blaming the violence on a film that's been out for some time that's apparently critical of Islam, and it's Mohammed, or Prophet, rather, Mohammed. As KKL 9's Greg Mills tells us, a Hemet man involved with the film is not apologizing. Police have put an end to an Ohio woman's dangerous shortcut. Neighbors say when she doesn't want to wait for the school bus, she drives on the sidewalk, and this video proves they're telling the Well, it's been an exciting day for hundreds of young ch school children who spent Wednesday getting up close and personal with the ocean. Whooping cough appears to be a growing problem, raising questions about how just, how effective the vaccine is that's designed to prevent it. In tonight's Health Watch, KKL 9's Lisa Siegel reports there are also concerns about how long it lasts. Stacey, thank you. Republican presidential nominee Mitt Romney is slamming the Obama administration over its response to the protests in Egypt. And tonight, President Obama is fighting. Democrats say in the wake of the death of three Americans, it is no time for Romney to be taking pot shots at the president's foreign policy. Susie, thank you. Tonight, we have new information on the murder suspect who led police on a pursuit that ended with a shootout in the streets of downtown Los Angeles. KCAL 9's Dave Lopez went to the suspect home today. Now, according to police, Ian Schlesinger is considered so dangerous, officers were told not to knock on his door. Instead, they were told to wait un until he, he was actually out in the open to take him down. And that's what they did last night. Tonight, the rest in peace mystery is solved. Police now know who's behind Facebook posts claiming a seven-year-old Fullerton boy is dead, even though he's very much alive. KCAL 9 Orange County reporter Michelle Julie has new developments in the story you saw only on KCAL 9. Why, why is it easy help. to imagine a student just kind of tossing the, uh, the ticket somewhere in the apartment and they just can't find it? That's true. <laughs> yeah. Clean the apartment first. You can check under the, you know, your books, your load, your load of laundry. Using it as a bookmarker for biology. You never yeah. know. Uh, still to come tonight, the new weight loss clinic just for pets. Poor woman. Police have put an end to a woman's dangerous shortcut. Neighbors say when she doesn't want to wait for the school bus, she drives on the side. Ten. Apple unveiled its highly anticipated iPhone 5 in San Francisco today. Some experts think Apple will sell 10 million of the phones by the end of the month. KKL 9's Bagad Jaban shows us what's new on the new iPhone. The iPhone 5 will cost between $199 and $399, which is the same price as the iPhone 4S it's replacing. When you unleash the creators of South Park on Broadway, you know you're in for some irreverent laughs. Tonight, the Tony Award-winning musical hit, The Book of Mormon, opened in Hollywood. KCAL 9 entertainment reporter Suzanne Marcaz was on the star-studded red carpet. It was allegedly cooler today. didn't feel like it. I, I think it did. It's, it's going to yeah. warm up even more, though, but <laughs> it's you hot, were still hot. Here. Well, it started <laughs> off with a little bit of a cloudiness this morning. Yes, and it, it felt did. It kind of cool, and yep. then it got really warm this afternoon. It, Ab, what's yes, up with it that? did. We're looking at... Park now. Ugh. Thanks for watching okay. KCAL 9 News at 10. Sports Central starts right now.